So when I think about great long-term holds, I think that ICP is definitely, definitely one of them. One thing that's almost a guarantee in crypto is that most coins is actually going to fail. Everybody knows this. And this is why you've got to properly position yourself into certain coins where you most likely know it's going to succeed. And I strongly believe that ICP is one of those coins that's going to be around for an insane amount of time and is going to surprise a whole ton of people. People might not understand it fully now, which is fantastic for the holders, but because once they fully understand it, then it's going to be too late for them. Uh, everyone else's bags is going to be full and to the moon. Now, in this video, I want to get go over the charts and a few other things. I want to bring up an article and talk about a couple other things related to ICP. But before I do all of that, for anyone that trades using leverage, make sure you check out my link to Margex down below. They've got a Casper airdrop that's still happening. There's only about like two days left. So if you want to take advantage of that, you might want to check out my link to Margex. It's also powered by TradingView. So you could do your TA right here from the platform, which is great. It's also no KYC, but let's get into things. So if I pull up this article right here, actually, before I do that, let's take a look and see how the fear and greed index is looking. We are back into neutral. And I talk about this all the time, how you want to be buying the fear because the fear and extreme fear doesn't stay there forever. Eventually, we're going to flip back to neutral. We're going to flip back to greed. We're going to flip back to extreme greed. So this is why you want to be buying the fear, right? Because it doesn't stay there forever. We all know this, but people still, for whatever reason, are afraid to buy when everybody else is afraid to buy. It doesn't make any sense. But let's get into this news right here. So this says that Internet computer dropped to 770, its lowest level since September 9th. Oh my gosh, September 9th, like a week ago. That's crazy. And 16% uh, below its highest point this month. Okay. The, the most recent ICP news involves a launch of BOB and MSQ Burn, which describes itself as the most advanced meme coin miner on internet computers blockchain. So there was a lot of hype around BOB and the hype seems to me anyways that it's cooling down a little bit. But what I did enjoy, what I did like about BOB is the fact that it's different. And this is one reason why I really like ICP. Everything around it is just straight up different. When you take a look at BOB.fun and you realize that you have to actually mine this meme coin and compare it to like something like Pump.fun, look at this. This is how every other website for meme coins look like everything looks like a pumped up fun you know you go on your website whether it be sui whether it be tron whatever it be right everything looks like this pretty much but you go to icp and this is what it looks like you have to actually mine a meme coin like it's crazy i absolutely love it like it just doesn't get more interesting than this in my personal opinion and this is one reason why I really like ICP. They're not trying to be like everybody else. Yes, to a lot of people, it might seem a little bit too complex, but it's so interesting for those who actually understand it. And I just love this project. This is one of those projects where it's like, once you get it, oh, do you get it? And I think that, man, I can't wait to see the future for this one. But if we take a look at the price action, right? So. Right now it's sitting at $8.14, a market cap of 3.8 billion. If we blow up TradingView here, I've mentioned this in my last video, I believe. Let's bring that over there. So ICP has been trading in this range for a little while now. So around $6.60-ish area around here and pretty much topping well, its highest point was here recently on July uh, 21st, which $10.77, but the most recent action is basically here at 870. So this is the range that ICP has been trading in as of lately, right? And it yet to breaks out of there. I still have big hopes for it because it looks like, mm, if you zoom in a little bit, is it making a higher low? Not, uh, Barely, not really, but barely in a higher high. Let's see this. So there, there, not really. Um, 
but again, it's super, it's super early. We're just at the beginning of the bull run. And regardless, if this thing decides it wants to come back down to $6.60, I think that, you know, we all know where the price is going to go eventually. So that doesn't even matter. $6.60 is just a better buying opportunity, in my opinion. Let's take a look at um, trade assist here and see how it's looking. So on the daily, a bearish momentum was fired a couple days ago on the 16th of this month. Whole ton of sell zones were fired for anyone that's just trading this thing. Um, the last time a buy zone was fired was, wow, yeah, at the beginning of August. So it's been quite some time. That's on the, oh, that's on the four hour chart. Let's take a look at the daily chart here. Let's see how things are looking here. So again, couple bearish momentums. The last time a buy zone was fired was all the way back in June. So the charts are indicating that things aren't looking that bullish for ICP, but eventually this thing has to flip. It has to flip, and I think that this is one of those coins where it's just a great long-term hold, you know, because like I said a couple times, a lot of people don't understand it, but once they understand it, they understand it. So even though, yes, things aren't looking all that great on the chart as of yet, um, this just means a better buy opportunity for anyone that's looking to really invest in this thing for the long term. The short term, it's hard to tell where it's going to go. We know that once a bull market comes, it's going to go up. It's a matter of how high is it going to go up in the bull market. That I don't know exactly. For sure, we're going to reach back its all-time high or its recent all-time high, which was $20. That's definitely on the table for sure. I'm not even questioning that point. But yeah, in the future, man, it's good. sky's the limit for this project.